they finally meet. Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump. Hillary will be the next president of the United States. Good evening from Hofstra University in Hempstead, New York. I'm divided into six segments, each 15 feet long. We'll explore three topic areas tonight. Donald Trump has agreed to remain silent so that we can focus on securing America. Well, I don't expect us to put more money into the pockets of American workers. But I remind everyone there are two more presidential candidates. Do you want to respond to that? I do. You know, I made a mistake. Running for president. And if I had to do it over again, I would obviously... Look, the African-American community has been terrible and stupid. We need to move on. Wait, there was an agreement. We did ask you to be silent, so it would be helpful for us. Secretary Clinton. Because the economy was on the verge of collapse. Gee, I, I hope it does collapse, because then I can go in and... Bernie Sanders built an unbelievable website. It's an unbelievable website. Bernie Sanders was taken hostage by somebody sitting on their bed that weighs 400 pounds, OK? I will release my 33,000 African Americans when she releases Bernie Sanders, as soon as she releases them, I will release, I will release my African Americans. We're talking about racial healing in this segment. Bernie what Sanders was taken advantage of, or maybe something more than that. What? And what take I a look at mine. Big, fat, ugly car. And we better be awfully careful. Almost eight inches, seven and a half inches to be semi-exact. My husband is not quite that long. And by the way, my car is the biggest since Ronald Reagan. I'm very proud of it. I will release my cum. I could do that very quickly. I think about this just a lot. Good. I want you to be very happy. Pretty good job. See you later. I'll see you in four years. All right. Well, that is going to do it for Donald Trump. Good night, everyone.